rocks up. Let's see. I'm going to take some of these rocks up. I'm just trying to get a little idea how many more I need to get to go around your, your thing. And we're going to come back out here and we're going to hook it up for you, baby. We're going to hook it up. Make it spin for me. Make it spin for me, Alex. Make it spin. You know I'm here. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. 32, boy. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. That go my boy right now. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. It's your birthday. Get busy. It's your birthday. Yes, baby, it's your birthday today. And I will rejoice. Okay. That's what I'm talking about, son. Happy birthday to you. Ain't no wind blowing. Ain't no trees blowing. <laughs> Won't he do it? Make it spin, boy. Make it stop. Stop. Stop it. God, I miss you. I know it's you. Make it spin, Alex. I miss you. Oh, I miss you. God, I miss you. God, I miss you. Oh, I miss you. Oh, you are so busy. Everybody misses you. You miss us too, don't it? Now make it stop. Make it stop. Make it stop, baby. You with me. Make it spin if you with me. Wherever I go, make it spin, please. If you with me, wherever I go, make it spin for me. Just make it spin for me. Don't stop. I know and I feel you. I feel Y'all hear some noise, I'm at the truck, y'all. But one thing that I want to say is that I'm very, I get very frustrated at some Christians, bro. Because y'all, all you have to do is open up your Bible. And you will see that the Lord is against sorcery. The Lord is against witchcraft. And the Lord warned against familiar spirits. So I don't understand why y'all be wanting to have your foot or one foot in sorcery witchcraft and all this other stuff and then the lord no in the old testament check out leviticus 20 and 27 go read it there's a whole bunch of bible verses where he speaks against that the lord is speaking clearly against sorcery witchcraft familiar spirits and y'all in the comments talking about Oh, Jesus, this is such a beautiful thing. That wasn't her son. That wasn't her son. All you got to do is open up a book. I mean, open up the book, the Bible. Open your eyes oh, and read. Why would you want to be associated with anything that's, that's not God anyway? Why do y'all applaud stuff like this? Bro, just say you're not a Christian. Just say that you want to take parts from all different types of uh, religions. Quote unquote religions. Right? Fates. You're not really rooted 100% in Jesus Christ. Because if you was really in your word, or even if you knew only 20% of your word, if you started in Genesis... And got to Leviticus. You would know. That the Lord. Does not like. Familiar spirits. <laughs> witchcraft. Or sorcery fam. Let's stop the BS. We all miss our loved ones. But when they die. They're gone. They're not coming back. There is no limbo. Right. Right. We grieve and we move on. We keep moving forward, hoping that they are saved and that we'll see them in heaven 
when we pass because death comes for us all. But we do not applaud as Christians. I'm speaking to Christians. We do not applaud stuff like this because no, because the Lord doesn't. The Lord did not send her son to spin that dang whatever that spinner, the mini windmill or whatever the heck that was, right? <laughs> but yeah, I'm just I'm just saying, y'all gotta y'all gotta open up your word, man. Anyway, I, you know, I, I said what I said. And, and honestly, the Lord said it. He said it in Genesis, Exodus, Leviticus, Numbers, Deuteronomy. <laughs> I'm just saying, bro. Open up, open up your Bible. Open up your Bible. Anyway, if you like the video, please like, comment, subscribe. Subscribe, I mean. Y'all have a good day.